It's the first Saturday night in the Big Brother house. It's the first time housemate will compete against housemate. New best friend against new best friend. Husband against wife. There can only be one winner. This winner will not only earn the respect of the nation, this winner will receive the most powerful prize in Big Brother history. Who will rise to the occasion? Who will fall flat on their face? Who will win Big Brother Showdown? And welcome to Big Brother Showdown. I'm Shelley Craft, and Big Brother has asked me to shake up your Saturday nights. Our new bunch of housemates will go head to head in a series of challenges, ranging from the rigorous to the ridiculous. And just wait till they find out what they're playing for. Who will have the stamina? Who will have the skills? Who will take out a prize which will see their position in the Big Brother game become that much stronger? Joining me to call the action are two men that any girl would be honoured to spend their Saturday night with. What they lack in athletic prowess, they certainly make up for in Big Brother experience. It is the man with the golden tonsils, Michael Goldman, and the man with the golden mane, Michael Beveridge. Ah, uh, yes. Golden tonsils, golden mane, golden pants. I want those back after the show, Shelley. Well, you can't have them. They're quite cosy. Thank you very much. They are mine. Look at this. How good is this show? This is magical. Showdown oh. is happening. How amazing are the housemates? I love how your hair blends into the background of the set. I like it that you've got a fine suit on for we once. We are having a ripper of a week here with these brand new housemates and the showdown is about to begin. What games does Big Brother have in store? Michael Beveridge, you are going to be our man mm. from the house because you were a Big Brother housemate last year, just missing out on the $250,000. You know what it's like, what's going through their mind oh, when yeah. they're going to win things like the presidential suite because you had the, uh, the captain's, captain's quarters Captain's quarters, last year. indeed, Mr Goldman, yes. So how would they be feeling? Well, first week, there's got to be some nerves, there's got to be some uh, apprehension towards going out too strong. Do you want to sprint for the first 10 metres? We've got a big... Big, big Brother series coming up and you know you don't want to come out too hard competition always shows the true heart of a, of a competitor it is all happening let the showdown begin Shelley thank you very much gentlemen may I say looking very dashing tonight and speaking of dashing let's have a look at our 14 fresh-faced housemates who are about to put their bodies and their minds on the line purely for our entertainment pleasure let's go to the Big Brother house where Big Brother is about to call them into the arena for the very first time just the terror. This is Big Brother. It's time to enter the arena. Stand behind the white line and face the Big Brother house. Two different things. Okay. Game on. Housemates, welcome to Showdown. Tonight, you will start as two teams. Divide yourselves into two equally weighted teams of seven now. Here we go. Yep. Uh, uh. yep. <laughs> <laughs> Drew, Xavier, Jasmine, Tim, Sharon, Heidi and Jade. You are on the orange team. Ben, Matthew, Ed, Michaela, Tully, Caleb, and Tahan. You are on the purple team. Housemates, tonight, 14 of you will start. But there can only be one winner. That winner will win not one, not two, but three significant prizes. Oh my God. You already know one of them. 
tonight's winner will spend the night with a housemate of their choice in the presidential suite. Prize number two is five thousand dollars cash. Would you like to know what the last prize is? I'm so proud. Big Brother will get back to you. He's a cheeky one, that big brother, isn't he? The housemates now know two of the prizes. I'm going to tell you about the last one. The winner of tonight's games will win the ever-important nominations superpower. That's right. This power will come into effect on Tuesday night and could secure the winner's place in the Big Brother house. Right, let's take a look at the teams for round one. We have the orange team over here. Drew, Xavier, Jasmine, Tim, Sharon, Heidi and Jade. And the purple team kicking off with Ben, Matthew, Ed, Michaela, Tully, Caleb and Tahan. Do you reckon there is an even mix of brain and brawn there, boys, or is it a little bit one-sided? I don't know. I, uh, I think we've got the gym hey, judges hey, hey. on whoa, one whoa, side. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's whoa, wrong with you? What's whoa. the problem? Big brother, $5,000? You couldn't spare that for us last year? Look at my wallet. It's empty. I've got a sushi train card. That's okay, all I've got. Okay, I can see what's going on here. A little bit upset. Last year's housemate, Michael Throw Beveridge, because they didn't have any showdown. Uh, the prizes were like a captain's quarters. But let's move on. All right, whatever. We've got a new show. You've got a I'm job a bigger this man. year. A we're looking man. after you Doesn't to make matter. up for it. So what do you think of the teams? Not so much evenly weighted. All the muscle heads seem to go to one side. Ooh. Caleb and Tim been against each other all week. Now they're against each other on the field. We've got the pretend married couple out there on the same team working together. They'll be under a lot of pressure. Mm. So will they accidentally let it slip that they're not actually married I during know. the showdown tonight? They're going to have to do what all regular married couples do in Australia. Let's pretend to love each other. Who knows what Big Brother has in store? Look, Back to you, Shelley. Let's start the showdown. Oh, you got your hands uh, full there, Mikey. I've got to say, was that our first ex-housemate hissy fits? We may see more of those in time to come. Now, we've seen housemates making new friends and hanging out this week, but I think Big Brother is about to take that term to a whole new level. Let's get down to the arena. Twist, I think, yeah. This is Big Brother. Housemates, round one is get a grip. The rules are simple. The first team to drop their teammate in the water will lose and be eliminated. Whenever Big Brother decides, he will instruct one member of each team to let go of the rope. The team who keeps their housemate hanging for the longest will go through to the next round. Housemates, your time starts now. <gasps> All about endurance and stamina. And it's hard for the people up on the rope too. Jade there. Looks like a tough job up there for Jade. She is a model though, so she's used to sitting around not doing too much. She's got to keep as still as she possibly can. And Tahan. Mm, clinging to a rope. Gorgeous girl from Darwin, lives in Melbourne. I'd just like to point out that I'm glad that uh, the girls have worn appropriate uh, pants. Actually, I don't know if they're called pants. I don't know if they're long enough to have the T and the S at the end. I'll, I'll just call them pants. They're not shorts, they're shorter. They're shorter than shorts. The, uh, the outfits tonight are very interesting in yeah, the games, I aren't they? I mean... I wouldn't have expected Matthew to be wearing pink shorts. You know what? There's a small part of me that thought he would, and I reckon there's a large part of Australia that hoped he would. The, the uh, <laughs> Barney, got... Barney Rubble fur coat <laughs> for Caleb, looking <laughs> very fetching, and the pyjama top for Ben for Brisbane. It's it's Ben and Jasmine let go of the rope and move to the bench. Oh, take the strain. Can they cope without Ben? I don't know about that. It's going to be tough for them. He was basically the linchpin of the entire hanging operation. Tully and Heidi let go of the rope and move to the bench. Good to see Tully. Tully and Michaela, looks like they're maybe patching things up. Tully and Michaela, they did patch things up they, after the uh, the war that they had over the bedding in oh, the halfway house. There's nothing worse than not being able to get a good night's sleep. Michaela and Sharon. I don't want to. Let go of the rope. Got it. And move to the bench. Okay, this is okay. where the men with the big strength come into play. 
Now is Caleb holding the rope for his entire team? It looks like he's just leaning back into it. Oh, it's fine. The men are chatting amongst themselves. Bit of gym talk there for the men on the line. You're looking beautiful up there. <laughs> Thank you. I don't feel very beautiful. This really like is Big Brother Ninjas. Release the eels. <laughs> What is this Big Brother has in store? No, did Big Brother just say release the eels? Do you think Surly might be planning his escape? You are not going to want to miss this. We will be right back on Big Brother Showdown. Welcome back to Big Brother Showdown. We are halfway through the first round and it is gripping, literally. And Big Brother has just invited some eels to the showdown party. So let's get back to the arena. Release the eels. <laughs> Now, I think it's at this moment that Jade truly realises she is in a bit of strife. This showdown just got real, Michael Beveridge. Oh my good Lord. Look at him slithering and oh. sliding their way this along is the not bottom good. of the tank. 50 Turn. eels in each tank. Jeez. This is something special. One's coming up the top. One's coming up the top. It's a big one. Our eels are bigger than their eels. Yeah, that's <laughs> they are. bathroom <laughs> chat there. They might Caleb like and Xavier let go of the rope and move to the bench. Oh. It's easier back. Well, the thing is, this is all about the last man standing. Now, sure, the purple team might have a couple of bigger boys, but when it comes down to it, the last guys have been holding off fairly well. Yep, it's going to come down to Drew and the other anchor, which is Matt. It's Matt. Army boy Matt. Now, let's not, let's not disregard Drew. He, he's a fit guy. He works out. He's been training. He looks, looks quite cock cocky. He's got a smile on his face. And he's got something to fight he for. He doesn't look worried. He's fighting for his wife. He's fighting for his wife. Matty's already fought for everything. He's fought for his country. Yeah, I reckon I... Well, you said you can't wrap your arms around, eh? Yeah. And Tim let go of the rope and move to the bench. This is separating the boys from the men. This is the moment of truth. Oh. It's Matthew from the Sunshine Coast, the GI legend, oh. up against Drew. Drew the fake husband. Calm and composed. Really from Melbourne, pretending to be from Ballina, saving his princess, his pretend wife. What's Jade gonna say? She, she has a feeling she's going in. Hey, Drew, you're in there. Hey, Drew, imagine you dropped your wife. That'd be really bad. <laughs> This is the talk of a losing team, and I do not think that, that Drew wants a part of it. He's not giving up. He's got a fair set of pins on him. He does have a fair set of pins, and he's smiling. He's cool, calm, and collected. And, you know, Matthew knows that there's a lot of pressure on him, and imagine the ribbing he's going to get if he fails tonight. He's been out of the army for a while now. You know, he's, been, he's a tradie now. Maybe he's not He's not up to scratch. Who knows? And based on his, uh, his, his, his maybe, pants wear of choice... It's maybe the pink... Shorts could let him down tonight. Pink shorts could let him down. Good psych up from the teammates. Parochial purple and orange teammates. It, 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 Drew and Matthew. Big Brother will count down from three. On zero, you may only hold on with one hand. Three, two, one, zero. You are joking, Big Brother. Put your free hand on your head. Housemates, you may not swap hands.
look at the arms. Jeez, look is at that the a... veins. Oh. Look, look at that. It's like a small is anyone, getting, is anyone getting hot at home? Who will fall into the pits of eels? Will it be to hard? Let's not forget that it's winter too. This is going to be cold water filled with angry eels. That could be a little oh. advantage. Oh, on your head, Matthews Drew. Come on, looking Drew. like he could lose it. Come on, Drew. What this is, is this madness? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, this is... Come on, oh, boys. so close. Come on, boys. We didn't think it would be this close. Go! Oh, no. Lost it. It's over. Oh, no. The orange team have gone down. Into the eel pit. He drops his fake wife. To heart is saved. Oh, I... Matthew from the Sunshine Coast, the superhero. Oh, <laughs> what made him cry? So much closer than we thought it would be at the start with all the muscle heads on one team. Amazing. I feel well, like I'm going to cry. That was gripping television. That was yeah, at the moment. Oh. There you go. The two fake lovebirds. I grabbed it. No one else Purple grabbed team. it. Purple like, team. Yeah. Congratulations. You are through to the next round. Jade, Big Brother thinks for having an eel bath, you deserve another chance. You will join the winning team in the next round. Well, there we have it, the first game, and I have to say the result was a lot closer than we thought. I did think Matt was going to crack at the end, but he just held out. Let's have a look at the replay of the dying moments of Drew's poor forearms. Oh, this is... Come on, oh, boys! So close. Come on, boys! We didn't think And Jade straight into a bucket full of eels. And I tell you what, Drew might not be getting any love tonight. <laughs> the next round requires two teams of four. Decide on these teams and move to the purple and orange zones. Tahan, Jade, Matthew and Michaela. You are now the orange team. Replace your purple bandanas with orange ones. Ed. Tully, Ben, and Caleb, you are now the purple team. So 14 is now down to eight. After the break, we will see which housemates have a way with words. You are watching Big Brother Showdown. Welcome back to Showdown. One game down, and Big Brother has only revealed two prizes so far to the housemates. The winner of tonight's showdown will be spending the evening in the presidential suite. And thanks to Ambie Purr, will be $5,000 richer. But what we also know is that tonight's winner will be the first holder of the nomination superpower, a very handy tool in the Big Brother game. Let's take a look at the teams for round two. On the orange team, we've got Matthew, Michaela, Jade and Tahan. And over here, the purple team, Tully, Ben, Caleb and Ed. Let's go back to the arena where the housemates are about to find out if their ABCs are really as easy as one, two, three. This is Big Brother. The next round is Words with Housemates. As a team, you must collect letters and spell out a word that answers the categories on the board. Housemates in the chairs. You must direct your teammates in the ball pit to find the letters you need to complete your answers. Housemates in the ball pit, put on your blindfolds now. You are kidding. You are kidding. You will collect the letters and hand them to your other teammate, who will travel them across the beam and place them on the board. Once you have completed a word, you may reveal the next category on the board. How do I find them? When your team has completed an acceptable word in each of the three categories, hit your buzzer. The team that hits their buzzer first will win. Housemates, take your positions. Ninja, reveal the first category. You are looking for a band beginning with the letter A. It's all about the calling this game. 
And off to a great start, the orange team, Matty, Matty the runner. Oh, oh, we can't have four! Caleb. But he's okay. They've got the A, they're going to start with A. Bands beginning with the letter A. Why not this at home? What can you come up with? Ben is going ben with all the grace and poise of a concreter left, wearing a tutu. Left, left. They have to have a band starting with A. The less letters, the better, the quicker they can be. She's going for ace of base by the looks of it. It's a bit long. It's a three-letter word. I saw the sign. I know, and it opened up my eyes to see Matt struggling with letters at the moment. And to your left, to Strong your leadership right. from yes, both yes, Tully yes. and Michaela. ACD. ACD. I think we're going for. F. One F. Okay. I can't see. F. Yes, 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 F. Okay. Okay. E. E. We need E. No, F. 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 Yes, yes, yes. We're done. Quick, 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 quick. We're done. Ball. Now we've got two bands starting with A. ACDC and M. Horse. And Horse are Band, I've but, um, heard of Ed Horse. I've, I've seen Ed Horse. They're okay. a, the kind of band that Tully, yes, inner city yes, Sydney yes, dweller, would listen to. Get it. Get it. Yes, yes. Keep yes. yes. going. Keep going, Caleb. You can the next. The next category has been revealed. You are looking for a kitchen item beginning with the letter B. It could be butter. It could be a bin. Beater. It could be could be, you know, a bulldog if you were a Western Beaten. Sydney Bulldog fan and you were in the kitchen. I don't think so. Maybe you just need something beginning with B that you would cook with. Michaela is going crazy. She's about to send the kids into detention. Michaela from Sashnock, the English teacher, screaming. <laughs> She's she wants losing this. the plot. She wants to win more than ever. Go. All right, big brother, we need the next one. Look at the stress on her face. I would not like to be a student getting a failing mark from Michaela. Tully seems a little bit more composed. The final category has been revealed. You are looking for a foreign city, beginning with the letter C. going on with the now, balance of the boys Matt, there. Matthew's having a little bit of trouble there, getting across the balance beam. He's been fighting in Iraq, in Afghanistan. He knows foreign cities. Jade, she can speak Italian. She's modelled all around the world. Listen to the direction. I tell you what, Ed is looking as lost as North Melbourne are looking this season. He has no idea the former Kangaroos player. Michaela, she's just a ball of energy. I don't know if I'd like to be in her class. I'm Okay, a lot of chatter here. Cairo, obviously the capital of Egypt. And they've done it. Orange team the orange smacked team. it down. Amazing. Well, who are we to say who's won at the moment? It's up to Big Brother. Michaela is shaking. Let's see what Big Brother has got to say. Orange team, congratulations. You registered an acceptable word in each category in the fastest time, and you are through to the next round. Purple team, you are out. Only four brave souls remain. Is your favourite housemate one of these four here? We have Michaela, Jade, Tahan, and of course Matt. Three girls in there that could take this out. Jade's got a bit of a problem. If she wins this, does she have to take Drew? Will she have a little bit of girl time? Or will she reveal her feelings for somebody else in the house? You know, there's only a few days left that she has to keep up the whole wedding charade. Don't forget that you can follow the house live on bigbrother.com.au or go to the official Big Brother Facebook page now and vote. After the break, it is semi-final time. You're watching Big Brother Showdown. Welcome back to Big Brother Showdown. During the break, the Big Brother ninjas have been perfecting their rapping skills. And no, I do not mean Jay-Z style. More like what your mum does with your sandwiches. Boys, please take us through what on earth has been going on down in the arena. 
I don't know about you, Someone but being wrapped and right constricted like that by oh, plastic is not something that I'd find fun. Now, all the housemates, before you go into the house, you fill out some forms, and one of the questions that you'll fill out is, what is your greatest fear? Last year, that was my greatest fear. So, Michael, where do you think Big Brother got the idea from? Thank you very much for this game. I don't know about you guys, but I am pretty wrapped about this one. Let's get down to the arena for the semi-final. Housemates, it will not have escaped your attention that you are wrapped head to toe in cling wrap. Yeah. It is time to wriggle it just a little bit. Wriggle it. The aim of this game is simple. When the buzzer sounds, simply stand up. Okay. The first three housemates to rise to their feet and move to the red zone will proceed to tonight's final round. Yeah. Housemates, your time Starts now. <laughs> they look like little toys that you'd find in the toy shop wrapped in plastic. Oh my god, I tell you what. So the girls have chosen great pet on this. The first three that get to the red section. They've got to get to their, their feet, feet as well. There is actually an art to being wrapped in cling wrap. Mm, I spent many years at the Cling Wrap Academy and it's all in the knees, Mr. Goldman. Once you're up on your knees, it looks like you're going to be making it to the red zone. Matt looks like he could get there. Matt's Matt almost got his up. up. Who's Coming. next out of the three girls? Uh, he's fought through adversity in the army, so getting up wrapped in cling wrap surely shouldn't be that hard. Jade, she's pushing. She's a model. She's been probably dressed in this avant-garde style of fashion before in her life. Oh, she. <laughs> Jade Tahan, having a lot of trouble. The girl from Darwin, oh, second on the red section. Tahan is up. Now it's a battle between Jade and Michaela. Drew calling for his fake wife to get to her feet so he can spend the night in the presidential suite. Yes. Will she do it? $5,000 up for grabs. Jay Jay, in a Jay, 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 Michaela. Who will get it? Who wants it more? Come on, oh, Jay looks like she's got it here. Could be Come Jade. On. Here we go. Jump. Here we Jump. go, Jade. Oh, Come on, push it up. Nice. Push it up. You're on a catwalk. Bring it home. Oh, and there it is. There it is. She's got it. We've got it. Our stick bean onto the red carpet. Drew is still in with a chance. Matthew, Tahan, and Jade. Congratulations. You are through to tonight's final. Michaela, you are out. Oh, forget Twister or Spin the Bottle. That is the best party game I have ever seen. Now, we have three housemates left. One, two, three. Things are really starting to heat up. Mike and Mike, are you surprised by who's left in the game tonight? Tahan, Matthew, Jade. I'm not surprised they all wanted it, but Michaela was so desperate. You mm. saw her in the in the words with housemates game. She was screaming. She was shaking with adrenaline. Yeah. I, I'm surprised she didn't get there in the end, but unfortunately, there's only three left for the final game in showdown. No, genuinely surprised over here, Shelley. I would have imagined there'd be more, more guys in there. Just, just the way, I, I, that's what I thought, but we've got two of the tiniest girls. Both of the hangers have managed to make their way in. Now, some might think that Maddie he anchored the way through. I'd like to see him get up. Does he deserve it the most? I don't know. What do you think, Shelley? Well, I'd like to see who he'd take to the house. Will he take one of his bromance boys or will he pick some sweet little lady to take to the presidential suite? We'll see, we'll see. Which housemates will bask in the glory? But more importantly, whose neck will be strong enough to hold up that massive medal hanging off our David there? It is showdown champion decider right after the break. Welcome back to Big Brother Showdown. Playing in tonight's final are Matthew, Tahan and Jade. OK, Mike and Mike, put your money where your mics are. Who do you think is going to take out tonight's title? Well, I think, it, you know, they all want to take out the title, but the people that deserve it most, Matthew and Tahan, they've been in the halfway house. Tahan had her clothes taken away from her. Yeah. She lost her hair dryer. Oh, she's, she's sprinkled a bit Surly's out of the eyes. back and played those tricks. But Jade, she's already been in the honeymoon suite. But, but that's a whole day away from the prying eyes and questions of Heidi, who was trying to figure out if their marriage was the sham or not. That's 24 hours. Of, of you know so saving grace for them. She, she, yeah, she does. And, and if they can keep up the facade that they are actually a married couple, you are right, then that means they are saved from nominations. Mm. Either way, it's exciting. Let's do it, Shelley. 
So you're both sitting on the fence, is what you're telling me. The arena is set. The finalists are ready. Who will be the first ever winner of Big Brother Showdown? We can't this it, is Big Brother. Matthew, Tahan and Jade. Congratulations on making it through to the first Showdown final. Big Brother would guess you are curious about the remaining prize. Yes, Big Brother. The winner of tonight's showdown will win $5,000 cash. They will win a night in the presidential suite with the housemate of their choice. And now, Big Brother will reveal that the winner of showdown will also receive the nomination's superpower. A power that could secure your place in the Big Brother game. This power should go to a housemate with a clear mind and a steady hand. Matthew, Tahan and Jade. Tonight's final is the Tower of Power. The housemate who builds the highest tower in three minutes will be the winner of tonight's games and the first showdown champion. Finalists, you have three minutes. Your time starts now. Right. away this is the moment we've been waiting for australia the final of showdown so much at stake jade from ballina we've got tahan the model from darwin that lives in melbourne and the pink shorted army man from the sunshine coast now oh we've got we've got tahan who's building a traditional house of cards style and we've got jade who's using her head and she's going with the flat cake style hold him in with the top one bub Yeah, it's square. Not a good start for Tahan. Great Jade start is, for Jade. Jade is obviously going well. Just just no balance whatsoever really there for Tahan. Matthew's still there at the first stage of his pyramid. Maybe you'd go for a couple of couple more blocks either side. Stronger base. I tell you what, maybe these guys skip block building tasks in uh, reception or preschool. Jade obviously Jade, has been paying attention. Jade, she was born attention. in Italy. Oh, really? she's, she could build the leaning tower of Pisa the way she's going. The nerves. She's, she's assessing the other teammates. They haven't made it past ground, store, ground floor one. The nerves are really hitting Matthew. His hands are shaking. He knows how much is at stake. He wants out of that halfway house, as does Tahan. But Jade, that's cool, calm and collected. Well, let's just have a look. These guys, he's, okay, he's going with the eye beam. That makes sense. The middle beam. Any builder watching right now would go, yep, that's what I'd do. Oh, we've had a, a slip from Jade. Oh, Jade was going so well. This now is really so all. She's starting again. Now let's talk about this nomination superpower. I've been there, I've done that. It means everything. It basically secures your place away from eviction and it could potentially get the person that is maybe infringing on your, your, your time in the house or perhaps who you deem to be the greatest threat to be taken away from the house. It means so much, Michael Beveridge. We've got about... 50 seconds to go. I tell you Matthew what. Matthew way out in front. He should really give it a rest now. He, he's way ahead of the girls. Matt, you've got it. You've got Matt, it, Matt. You've got it. You've got it. I would be leaving that. I would take a step back. I think he's going. No. He's going to go, go one go more. High. Jade is pushing for it. This yeah. means a lot to her. Time in the presidential suite with her husband, Drew, per per perhaps or someone else. Matt. There are 20 seconds Matt, remaining. This is, this is long. Matt. His fingers are shaking. Matt, it's gone down. Matt, you're way ahead. Matt, Stop. don't touch it, mate. Don't touch Stop. it. Let it go. He's staying back. There's no way the girls can catch there him There's no way the girls can catch up. The pink shorts have paid off for the army man from the Sunshine Coast. He's very happy with himself already. Go higher, Matt. Everyone breathe. That's it. There you have it. Over. The showdown winner, the first one for 2013. This is magical. Matthew, the army man has got it. I couldn't stop shaking. Every time I got one, I was like, <laughs> <laughs> well done, Matt. Yeah. Yeah. You got it, man. That's the one.
Matthew. Oh, no, Congratulations. Like you are the winner of the first Big Brother Showdown. Collect your medal and celebrate with your fellow housemates. I'd say it's not the first medal he's won. Hey, it's not the first medal. It was a battle too. It wasn't like the battles he's fought, but he, he stood brave under fire. His Lorna Jane hot pink shorts have it's held him in good stead. Testament to him. Oh, it's just my hand. Oh, it's really so happy for you, Matt. Oh. Well, Matthew has won tonight's games and is the first ever showdown champion. What do you think of that, boys? And how is it going to affect the other housemates? This is great. There we have it. Our first showdown Magical. champion for 2013, Matthew from the Sunshine Coast, has brought it home. And he couldn't have gone to a better looking guy, I imagine all the ladies out there would be saying, because I tell you what, he's big enough to take up that presidential suite bed all by himself, but that's not going to be the case. Yeah, no. Well, what, what's funny is all of everyone in the house are now his best buddy oh. in the world. I think Xavier gave him like four. Hugs. Yeah, around about four. I think Caleb came close to three. He's been in the halfway house all week. He hasn't complained much. He's kept to himself, and there you go. So who will he take to the presidential suite? That is what we're going to find out. That power that he has now and the $5,000 cash. This is exciting. It's, it's showdown. Our first showdown and our first winner do not go anywhere because right after the break, Matthew has a very big decision to make. This is Showdown. Welcome back to Big Brother Showdown. Matthew has won tonight's games and is the holder of the first nomination superpower of 2013. And I wonder who he'll take to the presidential suite. Let's get down to the house and find out. Oh. Matthew. Hello, Big Brother. Congratulations on winning the first showdown. Thank you. I'm stoked. So good. How does it feel? It feels amazing. Um, yeah, I'm just stoked, eh? It was a lot of fun. I had heaps of fun. Have you ever won a medal before like that one? No, this is awesome. This is better than a gold medal in the Olympics. It's sick, it's solid, it's, so, it's so heavy. Have you bit into it yet? Yeah, I did that straight away. And? Yes. Yeah, it tastes, it tastes delicious. <laughs> Not as delicious as those pink shorts, Matthew. They are very nice, aren't they? I'll give you, I'll give you a little look, big brother. Check them out. They're Michaela's. And they've even got the zip up the side. Woohoo! Big Brother has always felt it takes a real man to wear pink. <laughs> it does, Big Brother, it does. Matthew, tonight you have won $5,000. <laughs> thank you so much, Big Brother. That's amazing, eh? It really is, thank you. You have also won the nomination's superpower. And you have won a night in the presidential <laughs> suite. Yes. Matthew, which housemate would you like to take with you to the presidential suite for the evening? I'd like to take my bromance par partner, Caleb, please, big brother. And why Caleb? Um, just because I've got a good bond. He's a good fella. And um, I know he'd probably take me in too. What are you expecting to find in the presidential suite? Um, just hopefully a nice bed to sleep on and um, a hot shower. And maybe a delicious feed, like a, a roast or something, a lamb roast with some um, veggies and potatoes and some gravy. That'd be sick. You're an easy man to please, Matthew. I am, big brother. Matthew, when you leave the diary room, you may inform the other housemates of your choice. Yes, big brother. Congratulations. Thank you. And enjoy your evening. Yes, I will. Thank you so much. That is all. You. Yeah, <laughs> 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 um, you had a chat to me in that. 
And then he asked me who I want to take into the, um, what rooms are called? The presidential, yeah, presidential, yeah, presidential suite. suite. And um, I'll choose Caleb. Because I know. Yeah! He just told me that, and that was it. He just, he just asked how I felt, and then said, um, "What do I expect is going to be in there, and then who I'd like to take." Yeah, you, you didn't think of me. Okay. Huh? No. And Caleb, you must travel to the garden oh. and enter the front door oh. through which you entered oh. the garden oh. house. Oh. No, to the, so we can't see front, anything. That one, that one. Oh. one oh. That's crazy. That's crazy, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, bro. That's right. That's so good. Oh, I'm so jealous, boy. Hi. You know what I mean, man? See you later. Come on, Do open it. the door. Oh, yeah. no. No, no way! way. No oh, way. Oh my god. Look at him. Oh, what? We've got Papa. No way. And then I've danced and everything. Oh, oh my me. god. Oh, this is sick. This is awesome. Dude, you are the man. <laughs> How good is this? How's the bed, mate? Oh, it's a water bag! Oh, no, no way! way. No way. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're kidding me. How good is it? Oh, yes, brother. Oh, let's, let's have some wine, bro. <laughs> I'll see you, babe. How romantic. Oh, cheers, I'll put it around here. Bromance. Cheers, yeah, bro. <laughs> oh, well done, mate. <laughs> you're the legend. <laughs> Did we just hear the quote of the series so far? Let's have a wine, bro. I'm sure that's exactly the reaction that Big Brother was after. And I do know that that bromance is going to blossom even further in the presidential suite tonight. It has certainly proven that it's all fun and games. Unless, of course, you lose. Thank you very much, Mike and Mark. Should we do it all again next week? Thank you, thank you. Yes, the Why bromance not? will continue in the big bromance man cave. <laughs> I can just imagine them finishing up the night with a game of Twister and a glass of Shardy. It's beautiful. Thank you, Shelley. Welcome to the Brotherhood. Great job. Thank you, gents. You know, we started this week doing the twist, but things are about to get all shook up. Make sure you join Sonia at 8pm Monday night to see all the fallout from tonight's win, as well as the married couple revealed. That's right, the honeymoon is over. And if that wasn't enough, two new housemates also enter. And tune in for the very first nominations on Tuesday to see how Matthew uses his superpower. I'm Shelley Craft. Please join me and the boys next Saturday night for all the lowdown on Big Brother Showdown. Dreamworld, the home of Big Brother.